the book of traits, the book of attributes. Hanhogas Yishara's proper, straight customs and way to carry oneself. The Aleph Beit book, Sefer Aleph Beis. Nanachnach Mochim on chapter Das Ois Dalid, Cognizance. Cognizance 1. Sometimes God brings things upon a person so that through them the person will understand his mercy and godliness. 2. Someone whose mind is confused should frequently, freque, frequently say the prayer of the prophet Habakkuk. 3. Also, learning Sifse Koyen, literally Koyen's lips, this is the name of a super commentary on the Shulchan Arach, the Shach, code of Jewish, of Jewish law, is a school for this, and also eating wheat, is a school for this, and brackets for a confused mind, and, and brackets, and also eating wheat. 4. People's food conceive character in a person according to their character. Persons, f people's food conceive character in a person according to their brackets, the foods, and brackets, character. Five, the taste of wheat brings cognizance, brackets, das, and the brackets, to man. Six, wine and fragrance tune up one's cognizance. Seven, dissension causes the mind to be unsettled. Eight, a person suffers more from what he sees with his eyes than the pain that he feels from information. 9. One who engages in the study of Torah and doings of kindness merits understanding. 10. Through eating bread in the morning, one becomes wise. Through eating bread in the morning, pas shachris, one becomes wise. 11. The Holy One, blessed be He, emanates temporary prophecy to a prophet sent on a mission, even if he is not a sage. 12. The sage can grasp with wisdom many concepts that natural intelligence cannot conceive. 13. One who wants to become wise should turn south, in brackets, when praying. Rashi. 14. When a person wants to know what to do in a given situation, he should, op he should open up a book and he will understand what to do. He should open up a, in brackets, holy, and brackets, book, and he will understand what to do. 15. Olive oil tunes up the heart. Olive oil tunes up the brackets, cognizance of the, and brackets, heart. 16. One who goes in simplicity becomes intelligent. 17. One who has faith merits afterward to serve God with great cognizance. 18. Through awe, one merits to cognizance. 19. Through being acquainted with righteous people, one merits to understanding and cognizance. 20. One who conducts himself with modesty has mental clarity. 21. What is seen with the eye, that thing is easier to understand. 22. One who guards himself from food cooked by a non-Jew and wine poured by a non-Jew non merits wisdom and understands every book he studies. 23. One who is arrogant does not merit to understand God's dominion over everything. 24. When you don't do kindness, through this you don't have cognizance. 25. If you do any damage, you should know that you violated your cognizance. 26. When a certain understanding is revealed to a person, it is certain that he will soon be raised some height. 27. When one repents with all his heart, God grants his heart to know his desire and will. When one repents with all his heart, God grants his heart to, grants his heart to know his desire and will. 28. One who has not rectified his sins cannot have a relationship with God, in brackets, no God. 29. Through truth, you merit to know the ways of God. 30. Also, through hosting guests. 31. When you do kindness of truth to the righteous, you merit to know that all the ways of prayer, of eating, and of all the other pleasures are, are all the way of God. When you do kindness of truth, in brackets, truthful kindness, and, and brackets, to the righteous, you merit to know that all the ways of prayer, of eating, and of all other pleasures are all the way of God. 32. Through joyous singing, one will be a cognizant person. 33. One who is repaid with evil for the good he did, the Holy One blessed is he, has mercy on him, and grants him great intelligence in the service of the Creator. 34. According to the measure a man increases doing good deeds, so the Holy One blessed is he, de deepens his intelligence, that is, he gives him a great mind. Second part of Das Cognizance. 1. No that every world and every creation has its own unique structure and unique con construction. For example, the lion's profile is different than that of the sheep. 
in its strength and in the structure of its limbs, in brackets, and its voice, and brackets. Also, within the, sh the species of the line itself, there is a distinction between each one. Further, in all the created beings, their differences are all encoded in the image of the letters and their, pe pre and their permutations. And their permutations. One who merits understanding the Torah can understand the code of all the differences between the creations and will also know their unifications, that is, their origins and purposes, in brackets, beginnings and endings, end brackets. For in origin and purpose, in brackets, beginning and end, end brackets, they are united without differenti differentiation. They are united without differentiation. Two, no. That according to greatness of one's knowledge of the Torah and the nat and of the natural world, so the world is placed and committed in his charge. Thus, the lions were subdued under Daniel, for Daniel was a great sage, and no secret was concealed from him, and he knew the nature of the lion. The nature acts according to the wisdom of, of the Torah, and it is under the power of that wisdom. Transcribers note: I heard from our teacher Rabbi Nassim. May the memory of the tzaddik be, a, be for blessing that this paragraph too is connected to the one above it. One, to, to what is explained there, one who merits understanding the Torah can understand the code of all the differences between the creations, etc. Because this is the aspect of all the natural phenomena of the world. And building on this comes Article 2. Know that according to the greatness of one's knowledge of the Torah and of the natural world, i.e., according to how much one merits to understand the permutations of the letters of the Torah because according to the greatness of his understanding of the letters of the Torah and their permutations etc so too will be the greatness of his knowledge of the of the nature so too will be the greatness of his knowledge of the nature of the world understand this refer to Lakita Lachas Yardea laws of circumcision law 5 article 23 and 24 until the end of the chapter see there a wondrous explanation of this and it will forever be pleasant for you the truth is whoever looks with a good eye with a true eye with a straight heart, does not have any problems with this. Trans translators note, the opposer somehow took this entry and tried to use it for bad ends. End, end of the translator's note. On the contrary, from here can be seen the wondrous greatness of God and his true tzaddikim. The opposers who speak against the venerated tzaddik, who from the start look at his books with a bad eye, seeking and searching to make a libel, no explanation would be sufficient. For after all these words and truth, he will search and seek to accuse and wrong to speak against the above-mentioned tzaddik and his students. May their merit protect us, venerated with haughtiness and scoffing. Even still, I was unable to hold back from presenting what I heard a little about this, and the truth endures, whereas lies are eph eph ephemeral, 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 whereas lies are ephemeral, and God is forever true, and will save us from double-edged sword. Just like his mercy, blessed is he, helped us until now. Amen, so should be his will. Also see the Kitab Aran 119 in the teaching of the prayer of Habakkuk, and you will understand a little, and also see teaching 17. Three, through the comprehension a person reaches that the Holy One blessed is he is one, and that there is no other beside him. Through this, he forces the angels of heaven to form into a golem and embark to do his bidding. Four, Golem meaning a, 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 a unfashioned substance, a, a, raw sus, a raw substance, and he can embark to what he wants, he can make the, what, the, what he wants, and embark to do his bidding. Four, when thoughts of idol worship come to a person and he nullifies them by thinking of his faith in brackets in God, then his thoughts become an aspect of do, of blessing. Also, through this, his mind has fortitude and does not ever become confused. Even when the mind becomes tired from pondering some deep concept, then the Holy One, blessed be He, arranges for him thoughts which relax his, relax his mind. 5. Through the merit of those who sustain the poor, the masses are saved from plagues. Also, in their merit, expanded consciousness precedes constricted consciousness. 6. Even in wantonness and foolishness there is wisdom. Even in wantonness and foolishness there is wisdom. 7. The voice that emanates from a holy, intelligent person is a skula conducive to awe. 8. Through confusion of the mind, one's sense of awe is damaged. Also, through confusion of the mind, one's dominion falters. 9. The sages of the generation are the clothing of the generation. According, 
clothing the wings, the clothing of the generation. According to their wisdom, so too will be the drawing close in brackets to God and brackets and the brackets spiritual and brackets perception of the generation. Or the opposite, that is, becoming distanced from God, blessed is he, God forbid. In the future, there will be no need to attain godliness through smarts, for there, for there will be the fulfillment of the verse, your teachers will no longer enclose. 10. One who wants to have deep comprehension and contemplate some issue needs to attach his intellect to the holy temple. A sign for this can be learned from the verses, I raise my cognizance to the distance. And he saw the place in the distance. And he saw the place, brackets meaning the site of the temple, and brackets in the distance. 11. Through faith, the mind is settled. 12. Through converts, cognizance is increased in the world. 13. Even the prophets only know what the Holy One, blessed is he, reveals to them. 14. One who is a man of great physical might does not have much cognizance. 15. Large steps confuse the mind from in-depth study. 16. Through stealing, one loses cognizance. 17. When the coerceness of one comes into the thoughts of his friend, and the coerceness of the friend come into his thoughts, from this is created the sealing of the world. Travel, chapter, travel, derech, away. A path, away. 1. One who wants to cross the sea should take with him a bird and an ocean fish. And this is propitious, sgula, to cross the sea peacefully, brackets, safely. 2. One who cheers himself with the joy of a groom and bride as they exit the mar marriage canopy will not be hurt on the way, in brackets, his travels. 3. In the hour that the wagon drivers busy themselves with the carriage and with the horses, say the wayfarer's prayer to Phyllis Adarek. 4. A schooler, perpetuous, for someone who is traveling on the sea, he should take plaster, in brackets, lime, and brackets, with him, and he will be saved. 5. Someone who arranges parnasa, in brackets, income or livelihood, and brackets, for the tzaddikim, is assured that God will protect him, both on the road and on the sea. 6. Someone riding on a horse should take with him hoishanois, brackets one of the four species taken on sukkahs. 7. When you want to travel, bind yourself. Hoishanois is the, the last day we take five hoishanois to bang on the floor of the aravas. 7. When you want to travel, bind yourself first with the trait of trust in brackets in God and brackets, and through this you will not stumble. Literally, your feet will not be smitten. 8. When you set out on a journey, give first to charity. 9. All the ways that a person traverses, it is all from the blessed God, and they are the will of God. However, there is no one who can understand his way, except for someone who is humble. 10. When you carry with you stones that are found across the field, you will be saved from wild animals. 11. The prayer of Yoina the prophet is perpetuous, segula, to say on the sea. 12. Through accompanying a guest on his way out, the person brackets the guest, the end brackets, is protected from all harm on the way. 13. One who has no one to accompany him, in brackets, on his journey, end brackets, should engage in Torah. 14. A person acquires, a person acquire, a person acquires the place where he go, the place where he goes. Second part of travel, derech. 1. Through confession, one causes, one causes that the Holy One, blessed is He, brings teachers of small children that teach faithfully. 2. Also, one causes the roads to be repaired from stumbling blocks. 3. Danger on the roads comes as a result of sexual impurity, literally violation of the covenant. A hint for this from the Torah is, my going and resting you have an encompassed, etc. 4. Through traveling the ways, a man becomes a person of expert understanding. 5. On a night that you have a nightmare, literally fear at the time of sleep, and brackets, do not travel in the day. 6. Traveling in brackets and brackets, the roads bring a person to evil speech, lashonhara, idolatry, idolatry, promiscuity, and spilling blood, and these sins diminish one's livelihood. The road brings a person to evil speech, lashonhara, idolatry, promiscuity, and spilling blood, and these sins diminish one's livelihood. 7. Broad steps confuse the intellect from in-depth study. Chapter Dayan Judge 1. Any judge who judges truthfully, his judgments will not be annulled and they prevail even against the will of litigants, of the litigants. 2. As a result of Torah law, brackets, resolutions of a Torah court, and brackets, weakening, as a result of Torah law, weakening, 
through this, livelihood shrinks. Also, the opposite is true. 3. Through the appointment of judges who are unworthy come idolatrous thoughts. 4. Through marrying a Torah sage, worthy, worthy judges are appointed. Through marrying with a Torah sage, meaning, simply speaking, giving one's daughter or son to him, or being become a son-in-law. Son through marrying a Torah sage, worthy judges are appointed. 5. Through proper, through proper judges, the Torah is beloved in the world. 6. Due to the insults with which the judges are insulted, the crops, plagues fall upon it. The crops, plagues, and brackets, curse, on, and of brackets fall upon it. 7. Through the insults which judges of Israel are insulted, through this, inflation occurs in the world. 8. When an evil person becomes great, it becomes hard to deduce novel reasoning in Torah law, and also, the words of judges are not, are not accepted by the litigants. 9. The renewal of national and local taxes is through the judges. The renewal of national and local taxes is through brackets on account of and brackets the judges. This was Sefer Amidus Ois Dalid Das Derech Dayon. Das Cognizance Derech Travel Dayon Judge. Anachnachmo Nachmo Yuma.